Hi, I'm Ziamara Blanco and this is the ASUS MemoPad HD7. The tablet offers a great variety of useful features, customization options, and baked-in family-friendly apps, but suffers from lackluster performance. The 7-inch tablet ships with Android Jelly Bean 4.2.1, but ASUS promises an over-the-air update for Android 4.2.2 by its early August release. It houses a 1.3 megapixel front-facing camera, a 5 megapixel rear camera, micro SD expansion slot, micro USB port, microphone pinhole, and headphone jack. Even though it's also made by ASUS, its overall build isn't as comfortable as the original Nexus 7. The back panel, which comes in a variety of colors, slightly protrudes in a way that digs into your palms when holding it with both hands. However, the Memo Pad HD 7's 1280 by 800 pixel resolution screen is just as sharp as the first Nexus 7 and outperforms it when it comes to color reproduction. The tablet has a wide range of colors, which results in more nuanced details visible in images and videos. In addition, the tablet is preloaded with ASUS Splendid, which allows you to calibrate the screen to your liking. Another included app that optimizes the user experience is Audio Wizard. The feature allows you to enhance specific types of audio, but only works when you're using the speakers. It's quite essential to getting the most out of your multimedia experience, and the most notable setting is the movie mode. It increases the volume of the speakers and lets you hear soundscape noises that would otherwise be too subtle to notice. The audio wizard is easily accessible from the floating menu, which is activated by pressing the button next to the back button on the Android navigation bar. The floating menu and floating apps are an easy way to multitask and they help simulate a multi-window experience. It's a small window that pops up directly above the navigation bar and consists of a variety of apps that can function on top of whatever is currently on the screen. Instead of closing an app to open the browser, change audio settings, or calculate an equation, you can easily use floating apps to perform those tasks without interrupting what you're doing, unless you're using Netflix. Most floating apps will stop Netflix from streaming video, although YouTube doesn't have this issue. The tablet also comes with a power saver app that goes above and beyond most baked-in battery saving features to ensure that you squeeze the most out of a low battery. The downside to the Memo Pad HD7 is its sluggish performance. Navigating between apps frequently results in lag, switching orientations is slow, and the screen responsiveness is inconsistent. The ASUS MemoPad HD7 is chock full of features that optimize your multimedia experience and its screen's wide range of color is impressive for a small tablet at a bargain price of $149. But its inexpensive build is evident with its mediocre performance and plastic design. Go to CNET.com for the full review. I'm Ziamara Blanco and this has been the ASUS MemoPad HD7.